Rangers area. You know what Dennis Ham Ranger? Look, there's a juvenile bald eagle flying around, and he's almost black. You could not tell that he's a bald eagle by looking at him. I, I can, but what was that? If that is a little off river otter, that's the littlest one I've ever seen. There's a big old dead carp over there, about 60 pounds. Woo, yeah. Look at that, folks. That's a mo show for you right there. Yes, sir. Woo. My gosh, that bass takes two hands. And that bass would rip a small hook. I just put them bigger hooks on there. How about that, guys? Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Nice. Come on, girl. Whew, guys. Mo showed him found something special. He done put two. <laughs> I put one four pounder in the boat. I had another one on. I remember snipping my little braid line just a little bit when I was doing it. And sure enough, that other four pounder had just jumped out of water twice. Might have got it on camera. Snap my line. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm. You know what I need to do? I need to be just a little bit more careful next time. Hey, go me. <clears throat> uh, but I've seen a lot of big fish here. I mean, I got a client coming tomorrow, maybe. But let's see what we can do for the show. One for the money, two for the show. I mean. Two step all the way to the rodeo. Here's a new bait by Excalibur. A guy showed it to me at the boat ramp. And then uh, I threw it second cast, one swung on it big time. Bam! Oh, look at him right there. I hope you guy get the fish out. Stop a wishing, start fishing. Keep seeing, I keep seeing these big fish work inside these willows right here. I gotta throw my little old soft flip bait up in there. There we go, folks. Look at here. Oh, look at this two pounder. This is nice. Oh, this is a three pounder. Yes, sir. One more for the Omo show. He's a bad, bad man. He come with a plan. Gotta love it when you make a plan come together like that, Jack. Yeah. Let's not get too excited and let him put any of these hooks up in me. But damn, I hate that. Not only does it hurt, it's really expensive. Get them out. Look at that. I got to take another one for that. I got to read this message first. My client. Nice. Clear. 
clear, clear, ready, steady. Oh, that's that big fish right there. Gosh darn it. Come on through there. I don't even know if I can get to it. I'll try. Nope. Not quite. But boy, if I can come all the way through that brush right there with that, I think we pick one up. That's fat. Did y'all see that one come there and swing on on top of the water? Look at little guy. My goodness. They are loving that. Man. And these guys are full of energy. And that fish been caught a few times before I see the wounds in his mouth. He's a bad man. You know what? I'm going to give you a reprieve, son. Go get us, throw up, get us some more. Now I'm going to have to get me bait. That'd be a good bait right there. Yeah. Me and my yum, yum, yum. That's what we're talking about today, some yum, yum. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I like it like that. <laughs> Mr. Weichel, where the hell are you? Mr. Dyson? I can say that to you too. Wherever you be, whatever you do, quit. It's fishing time. There we go. Oh yeah, and that fish was right there. Not too far from where I hit. There we go. Come on. Come on. Mm. Look at here. This ain't trying to catch him, though. This is not what I'm casting at. They just can't get off the old Moso attack. Sorry about all that. Don't care to fish under water bugs. But I will sometime. I just know a man knows a lot about <laughs> knows a lot about fish says you never catch them under water bugs. But I do catch them on the water bugs, but I'll tell you, there's something to what he's saying. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, folks, we got something here. We better, no, we don't. It buried me up and had a high grill. That little old fish, he almost ripped that out of my hand. Oh, my gosh, quit it. I'll put a different lure. Throw a different lure. I think I'm going to go right up there by that lay down log and those willows. See what that brings, old papa. Look at that. Oh, I missed one already, guys. Oh, he came in here again. Well, I was reeling it in. Look at there. Look what that fish did to me. I gotta get a new bait. Well, good morning, guys. Welcome to the Mo Show Outdoors. We up here on Sam Raven, North End. And I found a pattern yesterday. It's a real good pattern. 
one of the better days I've had in a long time. And there's these hydrilla beds that are exposed to this main lake, main body of water. And here's a real nice one right here, and it ain't all that big. I don't know what the hell that was. But, uh, let's see what we can do. I saw a lot of quality fishing here last night. I didn't hook into any of them. But I think I might hook into them this morning. Let's see what we can do. We're going to start off with the old red eyed sexy shad. So take this and throw it right there, right there. Right there where it swung on it at. Oh, don't miss one. He didn't show enough come and hit it. He must be too small. Show's on fire. I am just on fire this week. Now look at what the most show got to do. <laughs> All right, that's a nice one, ain't it? Mm, thank you, baby. Bam! I know they're on the willows. I know they like to lay down logs. See if I can pull one on up out of there. 